Hey, my name is Bhavani Kola. Welcome back to another session of Face to Face to Online Transition. In today's session, we will be looking at how to download and use the snap camera filters during our classes and make our classes much more fun and engaging. This is so much fun and I cannot wait to share this with you. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. The first step is to go to snapcamera.snapchat.com. I'll leave the link in the description box below. Click on download. If you're a PC user, go ahead, click PC. If you're a Mac user, go ahead, click a Mac user, give your email address, agree to the conditions and click download. I have done that before. So here is my snap camera. Once it's downloaded, double click. The installation process is pretty friendly. Now let's go ahead and have some fun. So once it's downloaded, go ahead, open up your snap camera. And as you can see, this is my first thing that came up. I kind of like this one. Go ahead, pick what you want. Imagine teaching your students with all these cool um, filters in your face. Let me click this one. There you go. This is a fun way to change your avatars while you're teaching in class. I like this one too. Depending on what class you're teaching, you want to have that mood created for your students. This is one of my favorite. I use this when I have to tell my students, please do your homework. It's a very important. Go ahead, browse around. There are so many fun things that you can pick from. Here I am. This is Smurfs. I like this one too. So you're a Smurf in your class today. This is my favorite. I always like to have a pink hair. Imagine teaching your students like this. You will catch the attention and they'll have some fun along with you in your classes. As you can see, sometimes the Buddha also picks up the pink hair. So here is, well, this is cool too, depending if you're teaching higher ed and if they like something like this, go ahead, use this. But this is my favorite so far. They like to have fun with you. They want to know that you're cool as well. So go ahead, pick all of these. And once this done, once you've decided what you're going to pick, let me pick my favorite. Once you decided what you're going to pick, now let's go ahead and see how to use this in our Teams and our Zoom meeting. So here I am in my Microsoft Teams. I'm going to go ahead, initiate a meeting. And once the meeting is initiated, click on these three ellipses here to open the devices that you want. And in your camera section, make sure you pick snap camera. And as you can see, my snap camera is picked and all you have to do is go ahead and start your meeting. There I am in my meeting, there I'm in my teams. So imagine you teaching your class like this. All of a sudden you decided to change your avatar. Go ahead, pick something different. Let me pick my pink hair. So I changed it here and right away it changes in my team meeting too. So you don't have to worry about putting all the makeup in your classes. Use the snap cam, make it fun for your students. Let's pick one more. I'm going to pick a holiday theme. So let me see this one. Yeah, there you have it. But I somehow like the pink hair on me. So I'm going to keep it to that. Imagine teaching a stats class like this, asking your students to pay attention and making it fun for them. I really enjoy this one and I try to use this, especially when I'm doing a review session so students can focus on me. Depending on what class I am, I try to change my hairstyle. If they're not listening, I try to make it gothic just so that they can listen. Let me show you how. So let's say your students are not listening to you. Boom. Go ahead. Pay attention to what I am talking to you or, you know, pay attention to me. This is a very important topic. And once the, once you have the attention, go back and change it to something fun. So this is a cool way of having fun in your classes. I really enjoy this. And let's go ahead and try it in Zoom as well. So here I am in my Zoom. I'm simply clicking on my video settings and changing it to snap camera. And turn it on. And there I'm in my Zoom. Let me go ahead and change it to something else. Depending on what you're teaching, who you're teaching and what your mood is, you might want to change it. Please do your homework. It's very important. And let's say something is, um, it's a reminder. Make sure you take your test by December 15th. Absolutely no extensions. And then change your theme again. Please practice your review before you take the test. 
don't hesitate to ask me any questions. This is a fun way. I, I really like it. My students just keep laughing when I keep changing my hairstyles and the scenes. They like it too and I like it with them. So it's very simple, very easy. I hope you learned something new today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, please make sure you like, subscribe. And if you think it's worth sharing, please go ahead and do so. There could be an educator who might really want to grow their pink hair or blue hair or change the scene and make their classes fun for the students. And always remember, happy teaching and please take care of yourself.